Hey, how's it going? It's Keith Townsend from the CTO Advisor, Microsoft Ignite 2019. Wow, there's a lot to unpack from the keynote with Satya Nadella. I'm going to hit on three things that I think that are important to me and my audience. The first was Power Automate, which is uh, RPA2. Microsoft has gotten to robotic, robotic process automation, which is, I think, a validation of the market and I think a validation of my vision for the future of enterprise IT. End users are gonna drive innovation and the connecting of enterprise technologies to solving business challenges. In order to do that, you have to make technology more consumable. The addition of Power Automate, I think is a, is a great example of how Microsoft is driving that innovation down to the end users. They talked about 2.5 million non-IT or non-technology focused developers. And I think that's going that number is going to grow, especially with a solution like Automate. The other one is Synopsis. Synopsis is, oh man, it's, it's going right at uh, some of the biggest players in big data and analytics. SAP with BW and HANA uh, with their partnerships with Intel has been really big on analyzing that 70% of the data that we don't have analyzed to get to business decisions. It's a really, really big deal. They showed a big complex query that took nine seconds to run on their platform versus 11 minutes on uh, Google's platform. Microsoft is going right after that market. And then the other solution, Microsoft Azure Arc. <sighs> oh, it's pretty tough to explain it. It's uh, a management plane for the edge in Azure in multi-cloud. I talk a lot about the opportunities in which we need to move the data versus move the compute. Arc is a attempt at combining the two opportunities and being able to move your data when you need to move your data and then managing the compute in place where it needs to be managed, whereas whether it's Azure Stack or Microsoft Azure Public Cloud or even moving your data to AWS, which I thought was a really interesting multi-cloud acknowledgement by Microsoft with Microsoft meeting their customers where they're at. Then there was just a ton of announcements around Office 365, AI, they showed off a lot of really great collaboration tools. If you get a chance, go back, watch the keynote. It is an hour and a half packed full of just innovation.